on the beat about to spit some heat all i do is go hard even if that means defeat i live up to my name there is no one i could blame i'm the greatest alive i see my flow raekwon cool is on the beat about to spit some heat before i start can you please take a seat in today's video i'll be reacting to some scary story animations let's get into it A few years ago, my mom, my younger sister, and I went out for dinner at a local restaurant one night. As we were walking on the sidewalk towards the restaurant, I noticed a man walking towards us from the opposite direction. Well, I can say that Turn this was around. normal, but there was sort of a creepy vibe about him. He looked like he was in his mid-fifties. He was tall and had a dirty beard. He was also bald. <laughs> Anyway, we walked inside the restaurant, and the waiter led us to a table. Then, a few minutes later, the same man from the sidewalk walked in and sat at a table close to ours, which was so uncomfortable. I thought this was weird, but when our meals came out, I just swept away any doubts about him. While we were eating, I noticed that he was staring at me the whole time. I tried to ignore him. When my sister and I were almost finished eating, the waiter came up to us and said to my mom, Ma'am, don't worry, your bill has been paid. My mom was confused <laughs> and asked like him this? what he meant. And he said that the man who was sitting next to our table had offered to pay the bill for us. Although this was a cheap restaurant, my mom refused the offer and explained that she was creeped out by that man. The waiter soon nodded and went to go get our bill. When he left, the man slowly walked towards us, opened a strange duffel bag he was carrying, and pulled out two stuffed animals. The shapes of the stuffed animals were totally crushed, and I didn't realize that it was an animal at first. It was the most disgusting thing that I've ever seen in my life. My heart started beating faster when he came over to our table and gave the stuffed animals to me and my sister. Being a five-year-old girl, my sister was going to say yes, but my mom and I both interrupted and refused. Then the man didn't say a word. He walked back to his table and sat down. After the waiter came back with our bill, my mom explained what just happened. The waiter said that the man paid for his meal, so it wasn't possible to kick him out. However, the waiter said that he would follow us out of the restaurant to make sure everything was okay. Later yeah, that night, when we came back home, I tried to fall asleep, but it was hard you. to close my eyes because I was still feeling uncomfortable. I just laid there, and when I looked at the clock, it was around 2 a.m. All of a sudden, I heard someone walking outside my window. It was the fall season, so all the dead leaves would make loud crunching sounds whenever someone walked on them. At first, I assumed that it might have been some type of animal. However, I abruptly remembered the man from the restaurant and began to feel scared. The sound of footsteps was getting closer and I shut my eyes as tight as I possibly could. Knock, knock, knock. I heard someone knock on my window three times, slowly. I froze. I knew that it was a red flag and that I shouldn't open my eyes, but I opened my eyes cautiously. Then my heart dropped. The man at the restaurant was peeking through my window. With his glaring eyes, his eyes were fixed on me and looked me up and down. I couldn't scream at all. I just laid there, praying the that it must be a dream. However, he didn't do any harm to me. He just stood there watching me and then walked away after a while. I didn't get any sleep for the rest of the night. The next morning, I explained to my mom what happened yesterday, and she called the police right away. Get him, Karen. However, get him, although Karen. the police searched all over the area, they couldn't find him. They didn't know who that creeper was or what he wanted, but I'll never forget that night. Well, that was a weird dude. Karen, if you're still alive, I hope you found that man. 
send them to jail, and just be safe. Well, that was a crazy story, I guess. We'll do more reactions in due time. Hope you guys like the video, subscribe, share, and I'll see you in the next one.